Uh, this is Maginoni, and here's my reviews for uh, Incredible Hulk number 5 and Secret Avengers number 22. I'll do uh, Secret Avengers first. Now, I think the art direction for Secret Avengers is actually really interesting. I, I, it's a lot more uh, maturish, less uh, kid-friendly, just in the sense that the, the type of art style it is. And I think it fits this type of story pretty well. Basically, what's going on is you have uh, the reintroduction of the old, some old characters, then uh, some new blood into the team, and while that's going on, you have trouble in the Middle East, and they're basically introducing some new characters uh, to combat the Secret Avengers, and it all, everything is centered around this woman who basically was in the wrong place at the wrong time, where somebody set off a bomb, and then she sucked all the energy in and pushed it right out and blew, like basically killed everybody in the square. Now, well, one thing I have to admit is with with Captain Britain, I kind of like Captain Britain, but I think with Captain Britain in the group, it's kind of like it's a little too much, Captain Britain, especially with him being an X Factor, or sorry, X Force, and. I don't know, to me, he seems more of a Excalibur-ish type character versus an Avenger type character. And I'm not sure if that makes any sense, but the people who've read Excalibur and those types of stories, it's a little bit different than the look and feel of a, like an Avenger title. So it's going to take me a little bit of time to get used to him being in the, the group. Uh, there was a little bit of attempt to humor because uh, Captain Britain thinks that Cap Steve Rogers brought him in as leader of the team, and then you know Hawkeye shuts him up with an arrow type thing. Um, I thought the action was pretty decent at the end. Uh, of course, the Avengers get pretty much tranched, but you know, that was to be expected because uh, they have to come back and save the day type thing. Overall, it's a decent read. Uh, I like. I'm enjoying this better than uh, the single issues. But uh, we'll see where this goes. Now, Incredible Hulk number five. This is where we learn how they separated. Now, I think it, it's been long enough, so I think it can basically explain what happened. Uh, what we have here is the Hulk basically went to a bunch of people, and everybody said no until he went to Dr. Doom. And Dr. Doom basically said, I'll do it for you, but you're going to owe me big. And we'll see what's going to happen with that. Now... I thought the story was really good. There's some, there, I like the mutated creatures. The 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 evil scientist Buster team was pretty. I don't want to say it's entertaining, but I think it needs just a little bit more oomph to it. A little bit more story. For me, these guys were just there uh, that basically waste some panels. Uh, but uh, overall, I'm hoping that they're going to come through at the end of the story. The monkey with who is basically. Uh, you know, like a gamma radiated. That was awesome. And uh, they actually was actually was kind of interesting here since I'm here. Is they show the uh, Doctor Doom as he's uh, doing performing the operation. I thought that was kind of cool. But um, the one thing I'm really really afraid of is it almost looks like they're setting it up where they're going to merge again at the end. And I know they're going to have to merge at some point in time. And I'm okay with that. But I think, looking at it this way, it's, it's five issues in. You know, let's keep them separated for a little bit longer. And, you know, maybe we can tell some interesting, unique stories. Because so far, I'm really liking this run right here. And I'd hate to see, you know, like, a potential missed. But overall, I'm enjoying it. Uh, if you have any comments or questions, let me know. Uh, rate the video up or down, let me know what you think. And let me know what you think. Do you think the Hulk and Banner are going to merge by the end of the story arc? Um, new comic book days tomorrow, so I'll have that ready. And so until next